and welcome to my creative space thank you so much for being here today welcome to another diy video in today's video i have two diy christmas hair bows i hope you're excited to see how i created these so let's get started Here are some of the items I'm going to be using and I am going to start with this red ribbon and I'm going to take it and figure out how big I want this ribbon, I'm sorry, this bow to be. And then once I figure that out, I am going to trim it and then once I have that, I am going to take that piece, fold it in half and where I created the crease, I am going to fold my ribbon or I guess crisscross it and then once I have it crisscross I am going to um, adjust it to make sure that it's going to be looking good and that both sides are going to be even once I have that figure out I am going to take some needle and thread and I am going to be doing a running stitch and then I am just going to be doing that until I make it to the other end once I make it to the other end I am going to pull the thread and cinch the middle very well and i am going to wrap around the thread a few times and then i'm going to create a knot in the middle once i have that figure out i am going to trim the edges a little bit more because i felt like they were a little bit too long now that i have that going i'm going to take this black glittery ribbon and i'm going to be creating some shoes and i am going to be cutting two pieces off and then basically just turning around my bow measuring how big where exactly i need to be cutting and then creating the shoe and I'm just going to be using a pencil for that now that it's traced I'm taking my scissors and I'm going to start trimming and shaping this shoe and as you will see I also created the bottom part I guess the sole of it and that is one shoe and I'm just going to be taking my scissors and my other piece of ribbon and just basically cutting uh, using that as a stencil and cutting that off as well once i have those ready i am going to glue those in place with some hot glue and that part will be done And this is what the little shoes turned out and I think they turned out so cute. All right, now I'm gonna take an extra piece of the black ribbon and that is going to go in the middle to cover up where I cinched the bow. And I'm gonna take one of these alligator clips and glue that in place first. And then once I have that glued down, I'm gonna take the bottom piece and I am going to glue that in between the clip or um, I guess, yeah, I guess in between the clip. And then I'm gonna take the other end and glue that down so that is complete complete and secure. Now I'm gonna take this piece of card towel that I've used on one of my past projects and I am going to be using that to create the furry part on the boot and I'm gonna trim a um, strip off of it and then I am going to measure that into place, cut that into size and then I'm going to be taking some hot glue and gluing those down as well and I think they look adorable. And now I'm gonna take this gold ribbon and I'm going to cut a little rectangle and then cut the middle of that rectangle to create the little belt. And I'm going to be using hot glue to glue that in place and it's as simple as that. And here is the end result and I love how this cute Santa belt turned out. For the elf bow, I'm going to take this green ribbon that I had and I don't think you can tell but it has a little bit of silver hints to it and I really like it. So I am going to start by taking my ribbon and folding it um, three times I believe, like giving like three loops on that and once I have those loops figured out and how big I want this bow to be, I am going to trim my ribbon and I am going to take that and fold that in half and then where I created the uh, crease on it I am going to be doing running stitch on this as well until I make it to the other end 
once I make it to the other end I'm going to pull my needle and thread and I'm gonna stitch it very well in the middle and I am going to be wrapping around the thread a few times and then securing it with a knot now that that is completed i'm trimming the ends of this little bow and burning the edges just to make sure they don't come on rubble or whatever and then i'm gonna take this other green ribbon that has polka dots as well and those are going to be the legs of my little elf and i am also burning the edges of those as well once i have those ready i am going to move on to use this black greenish ribbon that i had it's glittery it's super pretty it's kind of thick so that's why um it's kind of hard to work with this but I really like it so I'm going to be creating a super simple bow I made these type of types of bows before so I'm just gonna let you watch now I'm going to be taking this red glittery ribbon that i used for my past bow and i'm going to create some elf shoes and i'm going to use the same technique where i just use my pencil <laughs> to trace these shoes and then once they are traced on this ribbon i am going to cut them and these are really simple shoes i think they turn out super cute and as you can see i just trace it with the pencil and now i'm going in with my scissors and once i have that cut down i'm going to be using the same shoe to trace it and create the second shoe Now that I have both of my shoes, it's time to glue them in place and I'm going to be using some hot glue for that. It's time to put all my pieces together for this elf bow and I am going to take a uh, piece of this red ribbon and cut a strip off and I'm going to glue down my black bow into place first as you will see now I am taking some hot glue gluing that onto the green bow once I have that down I took my red strip and also my alligator clip and I'm going to glue that first before I glue anything else and then once I glue that down I glue one side down of the red strip I hope you're able to see I'm sorry if you're not but um, once I had that down don't glue the second piece yet because I made the mistake here so I had to um, take that apart again. My little elf legs were a little too long so I had to trim them again and before I glue anything down um, I am going to be gluing those legs together first. As you will see I'm adding some hot glue, gluing those down and then taking that piece off again because I messed up adding some hot glue in between the clip, gluing my little legs down. Once those were down I am going to glue down the top red piece of ribbon as you will see and then clip that and then clip that in place and that completes this bow. I love how both of these bows turned out. Please let me know in the comments down below which one was your favorite bow. I want to wish you a happy and merry Christmas. I hope you have a great time with your family. Don't forget to hug them and tell them how much you love them. Thank you so, so much for subscribing to my creative squad. I am so close to getting to 8,000 subscribers. So thank you. Thank you so much. I hope you have an amazing and safe Christmas and I will see you on my next DIY. Bye.